Taylor, welcome back to my channel. I haven't said that in such a long time. I know it's crazy. I haven't posted a video in like coming on three months here and let me tell you, I apologize so, so much. And I know that pretty much in all of my videos, I say how I haven't made a video in a while. That's because I never really realized when I made a channel how much of a commitment it is between like editing your videos and filming them and finding the time to post them and all that stuff. It's a lot of work and for a person who is trying to get schoolwork and extracurricular activities done and all that stuff done, I'm trying to find the time to fit it in and sometimes it just doesn't work out. Like this past few months have been crazy with the school and whatnot and I'm trying to study for finals right now. I'm cramming in. I have four more days left of school. So once school is done, I promise you I will have more time to film and upload and edit to make my videos better. I know that my subscribers deserve way more than what they've been getting, and I'm so sorry. You will receive more content soon. So, yes. I know that you guys don't want to hear all the excuses and reasons why I've been gone, so I'm not going to say them. I'm just going to get straight on into this video. Today, I will be showing you my iPod 5 case collection. So without further ado, let's get into it. So the first three cases that I'm going to show today are all from a set, so I figured I'd show them together. This set I think you can get on Amazon or eBay. If I can find the link to them, I will put it in the description box below. Otherwise, you may be able to get them at like Target or Walmart or something like that. But they are just these three silicone cases. One is light blue, one is pink, and one is gray. I think that these are really cute yet simple and their silicone feels really soft so I mean they're fun to like grip on and hold and you can like match these to your outfits too I mean if that's the kind of thing you're into but yeah I love these cases and I recommend them if you can find them. The next case is this adorable chevron patterned hard shell case from the Macbeth collection. This I saw at Walmart, which is where I got it from, if in case you were wondering, and it had all of my favorite colors in it, and it was chevron, and chevron's one of my favorite patterns, so when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get this for myself, so I did, and I'm pretty sure you can still find this at Walmart. If you can't, or you don't shop at Walmart, or you don't have a Walmart near you, I would probably check online to see if the Macbeth collection has a website, but if the Macbeth collection doesn't have a website I will try and put the link to it at Walmart down below in the description box. As far as like protection wise on on your iPod I don't recommend this at all because I have two iPods well one of them I'm one of them I don't really use which is this one and I cracked this one last summer and it's just a pink iPod 5 now I have a blue one but my iPod was in this case when it cracked so this didn't offer any protection or support at all because as you can tell this case even got like scratched up too and I only dropped it like maybe like this much onto concrete. So yeah, as far as protection wise, I wouldn't get this but it's overall a really cute case so if you just want to have it as something stylish and cute to wear on your iPod and you know you're probably not going to drop it even though I didn't think I would drop it but I dropped it so definitely for if you're looking for a cute case but protection wise don't get this. The next case however is very well at protecting your iPod and it is this hard shell spec case with turquoise and then the inside and like the buttons are like navy blue. This is great at protecting your iPod, however, it was kind of cheap. Um, I know that spec cases are built to last, but mine, as you can tell, the buttons actually broke off, like they ripped off, and I didn't rip them off, they like just ripped off, and I don't know how, um, the rubber just started to wear away, and I don't know what happened, it just like fell off, so I don't know where my buttons went, but yeah. This case overall I think is really cute yet simple and it's very good at protecting your iPod. I've dropped it with this before and nothing has happened but the rubber kind of wears away at eventually. So I would recommend this though like a lot because it's great for keeping your iPod safe. The next case I have is this um, Panda Mimi I think is the brand. I got this on Amazon so I will put the link to it down below. If I can find it so you can find the exact name, but
but this is just a three layered case. It's got two hard shell things and then a rubber like protector thing in the middle. What's great about this is on Amazon you can get this for like less than five dollars and it came with a screen protector, a cloth like thing to clean off your iPod, and then a stylus. So I thought that was great. I don't think the screen protector works very well, but so I didn't put it on. But other than that, the stylus is nice and the cloth works well. This, I don't know about protecting your iPod. It kind of is just there. I mean, if you drop it, it's probably not going to keep it that safe. These things will probably just pop off and your iPod will fall and break. But I still think this is very cute and... It fits nice on my iPod. I've heard some complaints that these kind of cases don't fit very well, but mine fit nice, so I don't know. I would recommend this, though, for a cheap yet cute yet somewhat protective case that you can order online easily. The next case that I have is this silicone purple one with a really cute, like, line design on the back and then it has a thing to go over the home button. This is from the brand Belkin and this actually came in a two pack, one with a purple one and one with like a salmon-y pink colored one. I have the pink one but I could not find it for the life of me for this video but it looks just like this so you get the point. This case is really nice. It's designed so that you can grip it easily and with like the line designs. Um, the thing over the home button is really nice because it doesn't get like dirty and whatnot and like stuff down there so that's nice and it has like the headphone and the charger holes and everything so I think that this case is great it's pretty protective because it's silicone so if it falls I mean it's not going to do a ton of damage so yeah the next case that I have is this adorable Victoria's Secret pink mint green case and yes this is for a iPhone originally, but it fits perfectly around iPod 5. I'll even show you with my cracked one here. So as you can tell, it fits great. It's not like big or anything. The only problem is the sound buttons don't match up with the iPod in the case because this is supposed to be where the sound buttons are, but it's up here and down here. So I mean, that's the only downside, but it's not even a downside because you can still press them easily. The power buttons on the case and the iPod match up, which is great. Um, everything down here matches up. It's just a great case, and I think this case is adorable. Like, it's my favorite color ever, and it's so cute and stylish, and I just love it. So, yes. And also, it's silicone, so it's easy to grip onto, and if you drop it, it won't hurt it that much. So, I love this. The next case I'm going to show you is also built for an iPhone 5, but let me tell you, it still fits perfectly, and it is this clear, kind of like, it's the in between like a silicone and like hard case. It's like hard, but still like you can bend it. It's like a jelly type case, but I don't know, I love it so much, and when I put it around my blue iPod, it makes the blue iPod look purple because of the pink. And when it reflects off the sun with these, it looks super cool. I'll put it in here just to show you how it fits. It fits perfectly. It's not too big, not too loose. The only problem like I had with the Victoria's Secret pink one is the sound buttons don't match up. But that is totally fine. They're still easily accessible. And the power buttons match up too. So does this. So, I mean, overall the case fits perfect. As far as safety-wise, like keeping your iPod safe, I don't know how good of a job this does. I haven't dropped it in this case before, but I'm pretty sure it wouldn't hurt your iPod. I don't know. But overall, I really do like this case. And I got this from a friend, so I don't know where she got it. If I can find it, I'll put the link below. But probably not, because I have no idea where this came from. And last but not least, I have one more iPhone 5 case. Yes, I know that three of my iPod cases are iPhone 5 cases, but that's fine because they fit perfectly. This case is from Aeropostale, and it is just this super cool case where if you put it up and down, it makes different designs. It's so cool, and also if you flip it around, it's a mirror, so say hi to your, say hi to yourself guys oh I got a snapchat it is a mirror super cool 
love it and it says Aeropostale on it so I know that's where it came from but yeah as you can tell it's a reflective mirror it's so cool so if you ever want to like see how you look you can just take your case off and be like <laughs> selfie without an iPhone in it anyways um, I will show you how it fits just in case you're wondering this one is a little more loose not really though it still fits really well but the case just looks like this. It fits perfectly. Everything matches up. And this one is the best one out of the iPhone 5 cases as far as matching up wise because for the sound buttons, it's just an open area so it's no big deal. Um, but yeah, I definitely love this case. As far as protection wise, I don't think this would do a great job. But as far as cuteness wise, I think this is so adorable. Um, so if you can find this at Airpostle, I would get it. So that is it for my iPod 5 case collection. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It lets me know you guys want to see me continue posting content and that you enjoy my videos because that means a lot to me and it lets me know that I really have people out there that want me to continue posting videos. And trust me, I will start to post more videos soon as soon as I get like a break from all this madness, aka school. I was not trying to brag with any of the cases shown in this video. They were either purchased to me or purchased by me or given to me as gifts from friends and family and whatnot. So yeah. Bye everyone.